Dr. Darren joins us now with a look at an important health and wellness question from one of you. This one's from Barry G, and he's asking, can you catch a cold from being cold? Oh, good you question. hear this a lot. It, the answer is kind of, so the reason why. So our respiratory tract is lined with important cells that protect us from pathogens, bacteria, and viruses. When it gets really cold, uh, those uh, protective lining, that can go away, and that can make us more susceptible to those bacteria and viruses. You can't get a cold, you have to be exposed. You can't get a cold just being cold, but you can certainly increase your risk of getting a cold if you're outside and around other people who might be sick. So like put a jacket on, you'll catch cold is more of an old wives tale mother's tale kind old of thing. wives tale but it's got some truth to it especially if you'll notice when you wake up you might have a sore throat but as mm. the day goes on you take that hot steamy shower you feel better a lot of that is relining that mucus layer that helps protect you so always not wrong relined. not right not yeah. wrong not right <laughs> always <laughs> reline that mucus layer what's your prescription for wellness today doctor it's about how to safely dispose medication so the holidays are coming up we're going to have a lot of family members inside the house and the reason why i point this out is because this is often a time where i see people coming in young children taking medications that they didn't realize were dangerous and thinking it was candy. So how do we dispose of it safely? The first thing you want to do is make sure that you remove all your personal information on your pill bottles that has your address, your phone number. You want to scratch that off or block it out. You can check DEA.gov if you're looking for sites and locations where you can turn your medications in. And if you can't find that or if it's not easy to get to, you can do things like mixing your medications with ground coffee grounds or even cat litter. That, of course, helps the likelihood of it not being used inappropriately. Okay, very good to know. I would not have thought of any of those things. <laughs> Thank you for that. That doctor, course. and you can hit us up on Instagram with all of your medical questions at ABCGMA3.